the audio levels. We're looking pretty good. So, uh, as you can see, my club is on fire. So I just did a little bit of a trip to the uh, airdrop. I had a few airdrops. As you can see, I and it, it's it's just a block right now. But it's really, it's just a, let me turn up my audio just a touch. Because I can actually get backlash if it's loud enough. Which I've noticed in prior footage. There's a, there's a lot of touch and go. If you ever noticed, the series is very, it's, it's very basic. It's very basic editing. It is actually done in Windows Movie. I actually have a lot of food right now. And I don't really need to have this on currently. But we are sitting pretty when it comes to food. It's from random things. I also took a bunch of that stuff that I got from the... Uh, I actually got a shotgun from the airdrop. There's a lot of stuff that happened during all this. Am I reloaded? For some reason it starts off reload unreloaded. Make sure it's reloaded. When you start the game, you have to reload your guns. Apparently, have like the same... Go oh no, my bow's ready. Okay, whatever. But yeah, Burning Club. This also does have a mod. It has a uh, flashlight. <laughs> Pressing F. F for flashlight. So I'm feeling a little bit more confident we can deal with the uh, the horde that could be coming. Which is next day. Not sure if that's going to be today. But, uh, oh yeah, we got buried supplies. That's what I got going around right now. I'm really eager to try my club. Can I go through Trader Joel's to get there? As I could. Might as well. I'm pretty sure it has an exit point. Let's do a little bit of a uh, stuffing. I would like to do my uh, what's it called? Do a little bit more of the house, but I kind of want to just do something. When day seven rolls around, I'll do a bunch of things, and then uh, I'll cut to uh, I'll cut to the horde because that's what I'm sure everyone wants to see me go through is the horde. I'm pretty sure I looted everything here on off screen. I got a lot of cooking magazines that allowed me to make baked potatoes, all this other fancy shit. I don't know, you missed out on the goody information, but that's really all I did. I mean, what else is there to learn? It's really laggy right now. I mean, when is this game not lagging for me? Hence why I turned down the, the quality significantly because when it comes horde night I, w I don't want those frames to go complete the shit why is there a massive drop here this is a normal nazis game thing that seems like a like a fucking maybe it's supposed to be a crater Cause that seems like a random generation shit what a great place to fucking dig oh god what the fuck's with these drops i mean this is a natural road? Or is it a man-made road? I don't want to go around all this BS. I don't want to go inside a fucking... Oh, did I not bring water with me? Shit, I didn't. Oh, well, whatever. Forgot to bring provisions. Well, we'll find water along the way, right? <laughs> Man, it's going to affect my stamina, which is going to be annoying. Oh, did I have yucca juice on me? I think I did. No, I didn't. <laughs> Starting off unprepared. I knew I should have done something before that. Oh well. Well, with the magic of editing, I'll make it go a little bit faster. Buried supplies, yeah. Luckily, it doesn't seem like I'm going to die of thirst. Random pallet in the middle of nowhere. Where are the zombies? I want a burning club thumb. Why is it always on a road? Okay. Well, not quite on a road. Thank you, Lord. You can get more clay. More valuable clay. This is going to suck. This is a bad decision. I was hoping I would have had it done. Stamina is being an issue. This is asking for death. Ah, oh, we found it. Now, this could be a problem. Are they running? Good, they're not. Not quite yet. We have time. Burning club time. Oh, shit. Let's try the shotgun. Let's try our little pipe shotgun. Oh. Thing killer. That's unfortunate. Where's the others? 
trying to keep them down before they get aggressive. Is that all? Alright. Okay, let's uh let's get out of here. Time is of the essence. Now they're gonna become aggressive. Perfect. Now, what did I get? I don't know if I want to stop and read magazines, but maybe I should. Uh, improve seed crafting. All right. And we got peaches and murky water, a bunch of random crap. Seems like you always get murky water and not regular water. Uh-oh, here we go. Okay, not so bad since you can knock their asses down. As long as it's one at a time, you know? And my armor's weak. That's not a good sign. Okay, am I able to repair it? If I take it off, then I have the option to repair. Oh, okay. Is this thing damaged? Doesn't show a health bar on it. Oh, no longer shows the weak armor thing. Probably should have done that. Um, sweet home. It's always nice to be home. We can make some more meat. Luckily, I have cooking skill where I can make grilled meat now. Which I guess is better than charred, because otherwise you'd be, uh... Well, you know. Getting dehydrated and all that. Just put a little bit of wood in there. I guess we can make some more water. We can actually, I think I'm, I know how to make goldenrod tea now, which is cool. It's kind of cool, I guess. Oh yeah, I sorted, I sorted these chests. This is the food storage and all that. This is where I keep my food, which come to think of it, I should probably just take all this shit out of here. No point having all that food and water in that. And we'll just uh, put that shit in there. would turn into Trader Joel, but clearly that cannot be done. Let's sort all that. Is there another food? No. Alright, how's our... We definitely need to drink water. So we're looking pretty good with when it comes to water. Well, well, well. In fact, let me, uh... Let me take some of this with me. Can I... Yeah, that, that. I don't want to take all of it. You never know if we die and we lose all this shit. And then we can just do the quick stack method. Boom. Okay. Unfortunately, I'm, I'm kind of holed up today. Might have to just wait till... Mm, I, would, I mean, it's one of those things where you want to make the most of your time and do shit at night. I'm thinking alternatively, this little square here on purpose is actually meant to be a mine I want to start. I want to have this be like a house slash mining shaft. Which, obviously, I have some roof access if I want to get a good look at things. Clearly my wood situation is not enough to uh, upgrade all this yet. Which is an intention. Eventually maybe I'll paint this or do a fancy design. That's always the fun thing about 70s die is you can get into the whole the house building thing. Alright, so I did a little bit of mining in my house. Oh, Treasure's is not quite open yet, so we might as well take a little bit of a look at what I did. It wasn't much. It actually became day before I knew it. Oh man, textures are that bad, huh? At least <laughs> how I have set right now. And even then, you can see kind of like so. That's what I pretty much have started. Just a little mine shaft. I actually got some wood last night. It seems like zombies aren't so threatening. Maybe it's because it's still early up and early in the game right now. So I might as well do this until I hear that call. The Trader Joel's is now open. It's actually giving good experience doing this. Got some cobblestone I'll do for my little shit thing. At least the horde base will get upgraded over time. I'm leaving all that wood going to go into this. 
It's actually kind of a fallback base as well. Not sure if I want to proceed with this. I mean, it could always become a base if I do like a, a little bit more uh, security in the front entrance area. I'm not really sure how the zombies, you know, think. Did I get all this? Let's make it less, uh, go through all of our wood right now. I want to turn, I at least want to turn in my package. Turn in my package. Trader Joel's should open soon. And this is our little uh, shit box. I could have done better. <laughs> Probably changed at some point. Per normally what I would like to do is occupy a, uh, a, a current house. But we'll have to wait until that happens. Oh, it's not open yet. I see a rabbit over there. I really want to try to snipe. Oh, I can actually see where it made contact with. Gotcha! I guess Trey Joel took a little bit of extra time to open. Okay, where's the other arrow? Oh, there it is. No other? I heard a ching! And it just disappeared out of existence. Wow, it's really laggy. You made it to fire. It doesn't help. Don't mind if I point my gun in your face, Trader Joel. Nothing personal, but here's your package. Mm, shotgun shells currently seem pretty tempting, although I have plenty of them. And uh, not to mention, uh, it's kind of a shitty shotgun. I mean, it's better than nothing. Gunpowder is pretty tempting in the sense where you can make your own ammo. 9mm? I don't even have a damn pistol. You know what? Shotgun ammo seems very tempting. Shotgun can get pretty fucking savage. What is this one? Increases projectile spread. Hmm. I'll go with the shotgun shell. Any other jobs? Clear zombies one kilometer away. Fetches. Let's do a fetch. Really use some help for it. God bless you and good luck. I think just having OBS run makes it lag a little bit. I tried switching the uh, the downloading air time. Oh, what am I trying to say? The downloading source because I had it downloading on the uh, external hard drive. Hopefully, if I made it on the, hot, the main hard drive, it'd be focusing, you know, better. <laughs> you know, ah, computers, they are a fickle beast. There's my little mine I made. Now we are on day seven, so this is where we're gonna get our first, very first horde. Now, unfortunately, I might be spending time mostly gathering resources to uh, try to make my fort a little bit better. Kind of why I want the mine, because that would be something for me to do at night. Oh, wait. Am I actually making food? I can't remember. Oh, no. It's like done. That's some good food right there. Some quality food. I'm guessing they change it so you're not attracting zombies carrying meat on you. Because I guess it is kind of a pointless thing, because either way, it's like, well, you know, you might as well just carry canned food because you have food variety. Because it would show that debuff. I'm gonna go and see if I can. Uh, actually, let's 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 go to school for a moment. Let's see. We got a bunch of attribute points. We should dedicate to something. I mean, oh, yeah, it could become fit, softy to fit. What is it? What does it change exactly? Deal the headshot damage. Have 25% greater chance of dismember. And the percents go up. Also, the uh, tools governed by Miner 69er. I'll just get one more strength point. Might as well. We're going to need that. I think strength also helps for, yeah, shotgun, sledgehammers, and tools. So, it's stuff like that become better. We haven't done anything for fortitude. What does this do again? It is 
You aren't very durable or healthy. You're still alive. Deal 20% more damage. Dismember. It says resilience, but it also increases some form of, like, damage, which is interesting. But let's look onto the sub perks, which all this other stuff, like boomstick and all that. Blow off limbs, shoot and reload faster. Re reloading faster would be pretty awesome. Because especially using that pipe shotgun, it, it seems weird uh, to do that now. Disorganized. Carry three more spots, slots, uh, just additional slots. Yeah, that's what pack mule is. It's encumbrance. Although apparently you can get like pocket mods that can just override that, so that can become kind of useless. So you could kind of annoy, uh, ignore it. Let's probably look on our intellect tree because. It would be cool to have the, what's it called? I think there's junk turrets or something you can make. And do traps, which would be good. Okay, robotics inventor. Fascinating to learn how to deploy robotic weapons. Ooh. Maybe I should start doing that. That'd be fun. I think you need more intelligence to get this? What do you need? Oh, intellect level 3. So, what does intellect do? Is a measure of mental ability increasing... Intellect improves headshot damage with intellect governed weapons, such as robotic turrets. So, okay. You know what? Let's let's go for that. And then we can get our robot. You have a crazy thing that you could do some work. Robotic weapon deal. 30% faster fire rate and all that robotic in range. Does that mean I can already make junk turrets? Yeah. You can deploy robots multiple closest to uh, active. So I'll get one because I want I want to have a junk turret. That'll be fun to have. I'll just get into a, a less wildernessy area. And uh, oh, I guess I should shut that. And let's just uh, let's see tab. Can we make junk turrets now, or is that we need like a, a desk or something? Speaking of which, how do I make desks like better things? Do collector. Ooh, that's new. Do not remember that. Uh, forage. Oh, forage. Uh, we got a lot of leather, wood, wood log. Nani? How do you make wood log? Oh, just make it from wood. Pointless, but okay. Cobblestone rocks, we got that. Short iron pipe, we might have that. I don't know what duct tape? I know we can make it. Forge. Okay, so it was, uh, three duct tape, iron pipe, we don't care. We got leather, I know. And a wood log. I'll we'll quickly make that wood log. Exciting stuff, I know. And uh, we can grab the leather. I'm pretty sure I got a lot from skinning it hide. Yeah, look at that. We're pretty good. And then we can make duct tape, which would be under materials. I think it was three. Takes a little bit of time, but we'll have it soon enough. Where is forge? And that would be the last thing we need for a forge, right? Bada bing. It takes a bit of time. Now what's another thing we can make with our stuff? Wouldn't hurt to have all this shit. Loose boards block. <laughs> sinks and toilets? Is it literally just sinks and toilets? You make a bunch of them? Steel block. I guess that just skips right to uh, higher end buildings. Wood furniture. I'm guessing we can learn how to make other things when we get to that point. But anyways, we got what we need. Forge, or at least I don't know if that's what we necessarily need, but it would be nice to have a forge going. Oh, man. Ah, it looks far different than your shitty-ass little forge. It actually takes up a bit of space. I'm not sure if I want to have it here, because that's kind of weird. Shit, the feng shui. I, I, wanna, I need to move it there. <laughs> Damn it, I want to have it here. I didn't think it would take up two. Maybe I can have it here? No. Damn it. That's a little too... This messes up everything. I could move my bed. I could probably live with it being here. Uh, I'll probably just end up moving out. You know what? Fuck it. I think that's okay right there. And we'll just move all that shit later. Need to replace my bed. Uh, did you, there? I could also. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. With the what's it called? The land claim block. I'll I'll put that down eventually. Let's put my bed over there. 
And then we can pick up stuff with the Lankling Rock if I understand from it. Now I think we can turn in a lot of that material stuff. I think clay we can turn into sh stuff. I have on me. No. What was it? Oh, brass. You can melt down brass and then... If oh wait, does that work differently? Because I remember it would store inside. Yeah, look. Do you put it in here? Yeah, we put it in there to smelt and then lead. I think that would be best for being able to make bullets when it comes to that time. Iron lead. Need to find the lead vein, I guess, at some point. But for now, yeah. I guess we'll put some of our wood in there. Is there a way to split? Split. Oh, hold R. Oh, I'll hold the right click. There we go. Does it estimate how long that will take? Well, there it is. It's smelting. And then with it, you can create it back into lead, and I believe like bullet casings and shit. And clay. Oh yeah, shit. I'm gonna have to put a lot of clay in there. Which I have a ton of. Actually, I'll put it in later. Okay. We're doing a little home ec stuff. Which is probably drawing a lot of heat here. But for now, I'm going to try and get a little bit more stone. Which, interestingly enough, I think this is nitrate powder. Which, wait, did I respawn? I thought I remember destroying that. But we get nitrate powder and rock. Mostly nitrate powder. Which I believe is used for guns and bullets and all that kind of stuff. Which is weird, because I guess you get it from destroying bodies? Gore block bodies? Bizarre, but that's, I guess, how it is. I don't understand chemistry. Maybe our body consists... Our bodies just consist of a lot of nitrate. Really need to get a pickaxe. Speaking of which, am I able to forge a pickaxe? That would be a lot better than... Oh man, my stamina. I guess I gotta drink water. Gotta drink the water. Water's starting to become an issue. Maybe I should do a quest instead of... Oh, it's not giving me the red day seven thing. You know, like, heads up, brah. Heads up, brah. That's what I should probably do. Water could be an issue. I have this, but no... I don't think it takes... I need magnum ammo. Okay, what's the supplies that way? I guess we should do a little bit of something today. Instead of hanging around... Oh man, look at all those trees. Oh yeah, shit, I guess I better eat something. Mmm, -hmm. delicious. Oh, what a weird place to encounter a zombie. How's it going? You wanna die? Oh, no, you don't want to die. You're already dead. You don't have much of a choice. There. Now stay redeaded. Jeez, where on earth is this going to take me? Is this uncharted territory? It certainly is. It would be cool to head up in the city, but I'm, I'm guessing the game automatically puts you in the same area because it's a lot easier than being spawning in, say, the city or near the city. City? Oh, getting the attention of friends. How's it going, buddy? Looks like I got... Oh, I took off his arm! Awesome! That must be a dismemberment for my strength. Oh, it's telling me to go the opposite direction, isn't it? Damn it. I'm, t I'm stuck between a rock and an airdrop place. Hey, you know what? Let's continue on our mark. I'm not too far from it. 300 meters. Eh. And we'll go back and get our airdrop. That airdrop has some good shit. I don't want to miss out on it. I was kind of hoping the airdrop would drop at least in the same direction. Oh god. It's lagging. It's probably because the fucking... This little city here, or town. Oh god, there's a mountain between me and that location. Quite a sight. It's also probably the source of a lot of lag. Probably spawning blocks and zombies and all that other wonderful stuff. Random dude. Okay. I'm guessing after drinking water, I got a little agility buff where my stamina comes back really quick. Which must be that little little shoe there. Alright, pretty easy one. Now let's watch that grass disappear and reappear. Yeah. It's just a little cabin, huh? 
Well, actually, let's leave it open so I can retreat easier. Oh, a book stash. Happy days. Knowledge is always great. I hear an enemy outside. I wonder if I could sneak attack him. Oh, there's a hatch. There's probably more than, than just a little cabin. It sounded like it was over here. Whoops, I don't mean to swing that camera. It's probably not even a part of this. Let's see if we can hit him. Oh, that would be fun. Oh, come on. I see a chicken over there. Am I wasting arrows? Probably. Ah, oh, God, that would be so satisfying. Okay, never mind. Screw you, zombs. You're not even part of this. Let's go in here. Oh. Sneak attack time. A lot easier to sneak up on these assholes, it seems. There's going to be one standing around the corner. No? Oh, I know. Right here, right? Oh, guess not. Hearing snarling. Oh, I'm just paranoid. Something tells me the ground's gonna like break. Oh. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, he's a little slow. We can get him. Hopefully, not wake up the others. Oh, the other one wake up. Oh no, he's still chilling. I can probably sort of crouch, hit him in the shoe. <laughs> extra sneaky, yeah, extra sneaky boy. Could probably hit him in the leg, and that counts as a kill. When did the bonus damage increase because of agility? Because it went from two times at some point now to three point five times. Oh, random books on the ground. He was a nerd. Speaking of which, I should probably read those books. They probably just give skill points. Let's see. Trap crafting skill, yes. Don't scrap, please. Uh, let's hit A. That'd be quicker. Improves vehicle crafting skill, sure. Improves workstation crafting and... Cra what is it? R workstation. I guess you can make better workstations with it. Oh, my arrow, I guess. Delicious. Mm. Oh, okay. So you're just going to hang there until I kill you, huh? Yes. The fuck's with this house? So many crawl spaces. Is there another asshole in here? No? Oh, weapons bag. <laughs> okay. Okay, improves handgun skill. Sure. Let's check the toilet. Maybe we get murky water. Yes, we do. Is there any little plugs or anything else? No? Oh. This is probably where the rest of them are. And also the goods. Isn't this something you always want to do with your little shitty house? Just expand it? Create like a bunker underneath? Imagine the parties you could have without anyone getting disturbed. I mean, you can't hear easily underground, right? If it's deep underground. On the flip side, you could do some really fucked up shit underground, but, you know, to each his own, right? Oh? Who woke up? Oh. That big mama. Oh, gee. <laughs> nice dodge! Mama's got some moves! Oh, Jesus! I'm just hoping I... Ah! I'm just making sure I'm not getting ambushed. Damn, she's a resistant little one! Not anything but little. Little mama coochie in her face. Oh, <laughs> you dead? Oh man, she gives a lot. Oh, that's not a shot I want to see. Excuse me, mama. It's nothing against your sides. It's everything to do with you being a rotting corpse. Game? Uh, yes? Okay. Oh, shotgun shells. Did I awaken that zombie outside? I'd be amazed you heard all this shit. Oh, I don't even know what half that stuff was. What was that? Well, this is a dusters issue to make leather dusters. Make you oh, we can learn how to make leather dusters. 
Well, that's good. That's cool. This is armor. Heavy armor rating. Doesn't reduce me that mobility. Well, I don't even think I have anything in my arms aside from these shitty ass gloves. So sure, we'll go with that. I'll take more defense. And it's a rating of four. So fuck yeah. Okay, let's work and get stiff. I like working until I get stiff. I mean, what man doesn't? Oh, what's this? What's this? Improves a uh, harvesting tool crafting skill. Oh, that's cool. I'm gonna take the rest of that, because why not? And what's in here? Is this like clay or something? Let me see with a shovel. I think it's something, or it's cardboard. No? Ah, uh, it's like just regular cardboard. Ooh, Big Mama left a little bit of a little bit of after aftermath and coochie juice. Not cool on that. We're gonna do Freddy's basement here. We still haven't even found the location of the stuff. I'm kind of lingering. I mean, I, I should probably get my ass moving. Oh, pile of clothes. Uh, just scrap it. Whatever. In the old days, I'd be hoarding all that stuff, but I don't have much space. On the flip side, I think you can carry more, but on the but you have to earn it. It's chemicals here, I guess. Oh, what's this? Medical crafting skill. Cool. Okay, and a bandage. Excuse me. Excuse me. Is there more? I thought I remembered seeing another ladder, but let's go back here and see where this takes us. This pile of trash I missed. Maybe there's. Oh, duct tape. That's that's cool. Wait, what's this? Oh. I did something. Okay. Did that open like a secret passage or something? Or did it open this? Okay. Well, trash pile. I'm guessing I could have only opened it with that? Yeah, it was locked. Otherwise, I had to break through. Whoops, I didn't, I didn't take that stuff. Okay, package, where you at? Oh. Here. Alright. You were here the whole time. All right, we better head our ass back ASAP. We we'll still have some time before Horde Night. Now I'm almost thinking it would be a fun thing to do if I get a little more accustomed to this game is do a Horde every night thing. I mean, clearly I'm gotten a little bit better, but I have to work with the limitation of the hardware I'm dealing with. Clearly, there's a lot of lag spikes that could result in death. So this is more like I'm just getting a feel for this game. Maybe one day get a better PC or something. It's an, a laptop that's like almost 10 years old at this point. Maybe that's a bit of an exaggeration. It's probably like 5 years old. And it, it is a gaming PC. I think at some point the graphics card got worse. I don't know. It was running better. And now I'm trying to play games again. And it's like running like crap. So I don't know. Something got a little janky. Oh, the fire did in. Nice. Damn, I would like to get that airdrop. Airdrops don't disappear now, right? Kill 500 zombies. Oh, yay. That's cool. I wonder if it sees the Steam achievements. I guess it does. Uh, Morty! Uh-oh. Hmm. I guess I'm not done with this. Uh, okay. A good thing they, they figured out that that could be an issue. And they have some sort of fail-safe. I don't know what it is. Well, let's scrap that. Uh, free up a bit of a spot so we're less encumbered. Halfway. Oh, wait. Why can't I... Can you not move those? I guess not. Uh, I'm almost thinking I should probably just eat miso soup. Because food... See, there's a little bit of health food, water. It's actually pretty good. Oh, give us a little bit of stuff and make us move better. I should probably put the bandage on my hot bar because it is a lower tier healing thing that it comes in handy. If I get a little bit of a scratch. I've learned to <laughs> make gets work a little differently when I was fighting that spider. They heal gradually, not instantaneously. So I made the mis... Oh, this is looking way back. And observing the footage way afterwards, I'm like, Oh shit! They don't work that way. First time I really used the med kit in the heat of the battle. 